Hello everyone, hello YouTube, this is Felipe, o Gato de Salto, and today I'm here with another video for you explaining about the Samba Enredos of 2022, and today we're going to talk about Tuyuti 2022. Welcome back to my channel where I try to bring out a video every week talking about the carnival worlds, the parades, dancing and everything. So if you're new to the channel, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe and also share this video and this channel with all of your Samba enthusiast friends so we can make our community grow. Today I continue the series explaining the Samba Enredos of 2022. I also made a video explaining what a Samba Enredo even is, so check that out if you don't know. And today we're going to talk about Tuyuti 2022. Now, before we even start, please remember I'm just a regular person, I'm not a historian, I'm not an anthropologist, I don't know everything there is to know about Carnival. This is me trying to read and interpret the Samba Enredo composed for 2022. Samba Enredos are always very loaded with meaning and I don't know everything and I can't possibly access all the information, but I did my best and I hope I'll be able to convey a little bit of meaning so you understand more what they're singing about. So be nice with me. I have been parading with Tuyuti since 2017 as a passista, so they have a very special place right here. So yeah, To You Chi 2022 is also a challenging song because to explain and to retain and to remember, especially as a foreigner, there's a lot of words from Yoruba, a lot of connections to religious words, and it also talks a lot about the conquests and the victories of the black people. And I think it's amazing that you can see so clearly that the Black Lives Matter movement from 2020 obviously influenced the Samba Schools in Rio as well. Hi, baby. What's up? Do you like Tuyu T22? Yes. So the very first word is already requiring explanation. Olodumare. Olodumare is the supreme god, okay, of the Yoruba religions, Candomblé and Umbanda. He was the one, he's the, the god. Like if you, after the religious secret, syncretism with the Catholic religion, uh, Olodumare would be god and his son, Oshala, which, which will come up very soon in the lyrics, would be Jesus. So Olodumare is the main god. Olodumare Mando, so Olodumare, the main god, main supreme god, um, ordered Oshala me conduzir pelo céu da liberdade. So Olodumare, the supreme god, ordered Oshala, so his son, to drive me or to take me through the skies of freedom. Me falou Orumila. Orumila told me. Orumila is another Orisha, is the Orisha of wisdom, of knowledge. Vai, meu filho, semear pelo mundo a humanidade. Go, my son. Sow humanity through the world. So plant humanity through the world. <laughs> Nos caminhos de Exu, so in Exu's path, and Exu is the Orisha of pathways, of ways, of, you know, roads, streets. And if you want to know more about the Orisha, check out the playlist of all the Orishas that I made, because there's a lot of information that would definitely make sense once you watch those videos. Me perdendo, encontrei nua e crua essa verdade. So, as I lost myself, I met or found the naked truth. In Portuguese, we say naked and raw, the naked and raw truth. 
So the truth is all, not only naked, like in English, but it's also raw. Que a raiz do preconceito, so the truth, which truth did I find when I was lost? That the root of prejudice, que a raiz do preconceito, nasce no olhar estreito da cruel desigualdade, is born in the very narrow gaze of the cruel inequality. The cruel inequality in its narrow gaze is where the roots of prejudice are born. Very poetic, love it. <laughs> So, alabe gungunando o tambor. Alabe is a ogan. Ogan is within candomblé and umbanda is the, the people who play the drums. They are special. They are chosen by the drums. So, so alabe gungunando o tambor. E o alabe, this special ogan, he's the one responsible for making offerings, offerings to the drums, playing the drums in rituals. He's the caretaker of the drums. Trago cantos de dor, de guerra e de paz. I am this alabe, gungunando o tambor, and I bring chants of pain, war, and peace. Para ver secar todo pranto nago, to watch all the nago tears dry out. Nago are the black enslaved people. They were called nago. All of those who spoke the language Yoruba. E gritar por direitos iguais, and shout out for equal rights. Meu sangue negro que escorre no jornal inundou um oceano até a pedra do sal. So my black blood that runs onto the newspapers, or drips onto the newspaper, flooded a whole ocean all the way to the Pedra do Sal. Pedra do Sal is a special place in Rio de Janeiro where Samba is said to be born. If you're ever in Rio, make sure you, you visit that place. <laughs> Dandara, Dandara, another very important name for the Brazilian culture, the black Brazilian culture. Dandara was the name of the queen of the Quilombo dos Palmares. She was wife of Zumbi, okay? Zumbi was um, one of the last kings of Quilombo dos Palmares. He was a militant. He was one of the pioneers of the black resistance moves, uh, you know, against the Portuguese who enslaved black people during the colonial eras of Brazil. And in this quilombo, these are like small societies that they were able to form and live in after they escaped and freed themselves. Um, these quilombos were organized in a kind of monarchy and they had kings and queens. And one of the most famous king of the most famous quilombo we had in Brazil, Quilombo dos Palmares, was Zumbi dos Palmares, the king of Zumbi of, of dos Palmares, and his wife, his queen, was called Dandara. So it's very normal to see in Samba, in here, those, the names Zumbi and Dandara, just like here. A espada e a palavra, the word and this word, <laughs> this word and the word, e. Não vai ser escrava, it's not going to be a slave. E de ver noutras negras minas, you will be able to see in other women, black women, um baobá malê, a malê baobá, baobá, the, the sacred African tree that, that retains lots of water, the sacred baobá tree. Malê is an adjective, it's uh, the Muslim blacks, so it's the people who were enslaved and taken to Brazil, but from the northeast of Africa, who were Muslims. So they are saying here that Dandara, um, from the word and the word, won't be a slave. We'll see in other black women a Muslim black baobab tree, so a, a 
sacred tree that will sprout from the ground, que nasce do chão, sprout from the ground, para vencer a opressão, to conquer or to um, have victory over oppression, com a força da melanina, with the strength of the melanin. Okay? Very beautiful. <música> Negro é cultura e saber, so black is the knowledge and, and culture. Caribatie, that's the that's, that's title of the song, and it means may our paths open. Okay? In Yoruba. Caminhos de sol, so ways of the sun, enlightened by the sun, paths is brightened by the sun. Now here they, they start mentioning names of black people who are important for the culture and the knowledge of Brazil, arts and sciences. Grande Otelo was a, a Brazilian actor, a very well-known actor, also present in movies and theater plays. Mãe Estela de Chossi, who was um, a, a very important name for literature. She was part of the Academia de Letras da Bahia, so the Academy of Letters. Um, of Bahia, and Teresa de Benguela, also a Quilombo leader. She was also a Quilombola. So yes, again, black prominence and important people from the black Brazilian culture. Se fazem farol, and they are the guiding lights para iluminar alafins, to enlighten future emperors, so future no nobles, black nobles. E morrer só de rir feito mil Benjamins, and they will only die of laughter, just like a thousand Benjamins. Benjamins is the name of another black um, personality. He was the very first clown, circus clown, um, black circus clown of Brazil. Salgueiro sang about Benjamin, this, this clown, this black clown in 2020. That was the last carnival um, before the pandemics. I was there in the parade. In the very first group, in the very first ala, we represented circus uh, lions. E cantar, 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 and sing, sing, sing. A beleza retinta que veio de lá. So the, the black, the auburn beauty that came from there. So again, the, the meaning of, of, you know, the person of color. E cantar, e cantar, e cantar. So and sing, and sing, and sing again. Para saudar meu orixá. To salute my orixá. And this is the chorus, is my favorite part. Also gives me goosebumps. Ogunye, o que aro? Ogunye is the salutation for Ogun, Orisha of War. O que aro, the salutation for Oshosi, Orisha of Hunt. Laroye, meu pai kao, laroye. Salutation for Eshu, um, Orisha of Pathways. Kao, salutation for Shango, Orisha of Justice. Laroye, meu pai Kao, so Laroye, Eshu. Meu pai, my father, Kao. Tem sangue nobre de Mandela e de zumbi. There are noble, there is noble blood of Mandela, Nelson Mandela, and zumbi, zumbi dos palmares. Nas veias do povo preto do meu Tuiuti. Nas veias do povo preto do meu Tuiuti. In the veins of the black people of my Tuiuti. Oguie, eu quero. Laroie, meu pai caô. So I'll leave you with this beautiful song. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next week with another Samai Bye. Oguie, eu quero. Oguie, eu quero. Claro,